When I became a Muslim in 1985, there was a woman who spoke at Isna. And I remember looking at her from the audience. She was very tall, mashallah. And she was very, she was a wonderful speaker, very motivating. And I remember thinking, oh, I'd, I'd like to be her. And her name was Amina Asalmi. Rahmatullah alayha. May Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala reward her and grant her his mercy. Amina Asalmi had a life full of living for Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. She created positive cultural change. She opened institutions. She spoke. She taught. And this month, we are honoring her with the We Are Amina, Amina Asilmi campaign. Many of you have nominated your relatives and friends who are also fighting against injustice, who are creative educators, who are positive cultural change makers, who uphold family ties, who take care of their community. And we are looking forward to remembering the helpers, as Mr. Rogers used to say. As we look around, we recognize that women are needed. Women are needed to stand up and do the work that needs to be done. Women like Amina Asilmi, who stood for justice, are always needed. And here at Rabata, we are working to create an entire generation of women like her and like the women who came before her. We ask that as you watch these videos and remember her good work, as you remember the people in your community who are doing good work, or maybe in your digital community who are doing excellent work, that you look to Rabata and remember that we are working very hard to make sure that there are always Amina Asilmis. There are always women who will stand up. There are always women who will put up their hands and make dua and it will be answered. We ask you to donate and help us reach our goal at the end of the year. May Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala reward you and reward those that you reach out to and reward everyone that Amina Asilmi has affected and touched during her life. And inshallah, help this work to keep going and keep growing so that we can see the bright future that she imagined, the bright future that we all imagine, the light and the love and peace and end of oppression that we all are praying for.